What's going on guys, it's your boy Nas. Welcome back to another Duncan video. Today I'll be showing you how if the uh, register is worked. Uh, I'm not sure if you have the same register as I do, but if you do, definitely it would be a help for you to understand where the options are in each section and where to find certain things. I'll definitely be able to show you that. Let's see if I can today. Uh, if you haven't checked out my previous video, go check it out. Uh, I literally talk about the new barista uh, latte express espresso machine that we use. And if you have the same espresso machine at your Duncan, that video might be a little helpful to you. So pretty much this is how my register looks. You have um, selection of brew bars in the top, the size of the drinks. What Usually we sell a lot of coffees and iced coffee, so that will be your first options right here. Then you have your cold brew on the side. Um, for example, if you click small, you would have to, it usually doesn't actually charge anything until you, you know, select what how um, what kind of drink they're ordering. So if it's hot, you click hot. As you can see, the sign has changed. If you go ice, the sign also has changed. But you didn't have to delete or anything. It just changed whatever the drink the, um, the customer is ordering. So you know you have your decaf, then your midnight Dunkin', winter blend, and holiday blend. So if they order either of those, you just click on the, instead of original. So that price is gonna be here, the name is gonna be there. Um, same thing as like hot or ice, so definitely. Um, as you can see, your options of, you know, dairies and sugar options are in the in this screen as well um so pretty much you know then it's also on the sidebar you can see that there's a dairy option there's the swirl options there's the flavor options you go to swirls as you can see all the swirls that we have are listed as well up to you you know selected a few items let's say the customer wanted caramel and go to dairy then cream and sugar after that, when you click item is done, there's a printout comes in. You know how if you go to regular restaurants, this the cook person actually looks at what the order is. So it's pretty much those kind of sticker that comes out once you click um, item is done. So as far as like if they want espressos, you got that on the side. As you can see, the same thing, how do I sizes and what kind of drink it is. The hot beverage, as you can see, all the hot chocolate, Dunkachino, and vanilla spice is gonna be here. Other beverage, you mostly go here for refreshers. Some of this is already there for you. Um, then if you go to the bakery, you got donuts listed. You got munchkin listed as well. Then extra things that, that we usually get seasonal, we'll have them over here as well. Um, snacking it is probably one of the options that we always click because these people, I mean, customers, they love, you know, snacking bacon, pancakes, avocado toast. Um, you know, then if you go to bagels and muffins, you see muffins, you have bagels options. Let's go to the sandwich. So you click every section, it has their own button. So you click, like, go to beverage or bakery, sandwich. All your sandwiches listed here as well. Hash browns on the side, then the wraps, the meat, eggs, snacking as well. Otherwise, those are the few things that you would have to look towards the register just to see where these few options are. Um, you know, price is really like they got five, 10 and 20, which is a lot easier for, for us to take the money and do the transaction a lot faster. Otherwise, beverage, you got your size, hot or ice, what kind of coffee, uh, then once you click on those options, you know, you could, there will be a menu, a menu on this side telling you what kind of dairy they want, what kind of swirl they want. So this, these things are very easy to learn. Um, I hope this video definitely helped. I, I hope that video definitely helped. Uh, I know register could be very complicated based on you know, it's not like something you can train yourself, you need somebody, and you get customers all the time, so it's 
one option is very difficult to find and the customer either has no patience or they either waiting expecting you to know and things could get a little difficult when in that situation but otherwise looking at the register it absolutely helps you pause the video on each section and see where the options are and it might actually help you absolutely you know what i mean so i appreciate that you guys are watching my videos if this video helped a lot you know give this video a thumbs up subscribe click that notification it absolutely helps my channel grow bigger uh, so i hope you guys could uh, learn something from this video and i check on you guys later and I'll probably make another video this week or maybe next week so let me know what kind of video you want me to make i'll definitely try my best but i appreciate that you are watching this